Yo, tell them, and we on once again. What's up, Donalds? Welcome back to the Wolf Among Us series. Hope y'all enjoying this playthrough. If so, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, hit the noti bell. We picking right back up where we left off last week. Hope y'all got your apple juice, y'all orange juice, y'all water, y'all milk, y'all coffee, whatever y'all need to go ahead and finish today's episode. Let's go ahead and get right to it. Y'all feel me? Yeah, I had to say this until we got back here. I mean. Ah, uh, <laughs> for real, Wolf. I was expecting the genie to come out. No cap. Hey, Magic Mirror. I got a question. You know. Oh, this really the mirror? Whoa, nigga! You look spooky. You Your look like an evil mirror. Callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some. You have an ugly face to see this morning. Ew. Mirror, mirror. If you're able, tell me all about this fable. See, was that so hard? Yeah, I'm about yeah, it two seconds weird. away from kicking a <laughs> hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Oh, um. Show me the woodsman. Hmm. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. He was by a pawn shop. Street. I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Who's by? Who's by the pawn shop? Yeah. Huh. <laughs> Not much of a request. This is Bigby. <laughs> What's Buffkin Show doing? Buffkin. Hey, put oh down the gosh. bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Mm. Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. That's all that bottle well, you've been I'm sipping sure back there, man. Dude can't even fly okay. straight. Thank you. Well, these sweethearts are smacking right now, dog. Can't get mad, he get right to work. Okay, what else y'all want uh y'all need me to do? Hold on. No, no, cause the lady I'm with is Snow White. Hold on, but there's that symbol right there. Hold up. Ah, great. What? I can't read any of this shit. <laughs> I can help. Maybe it will brighten your shitty mood a little. Unlikely. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alerlairau. I'll go look it up. Alerlairau. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, also known as <laughs> ass skin. <laughs> I prefer to go by the name Faith. Poetic. Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. <laughs> the story of donkey skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... That's one hell of a name. What? His daughter, Faith. What? She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey. 
that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Bro, some of these, bro, I'm telling you, bro, some of these Disney movies, uh, some, all of them, bro, Should they I like. Market, Miss Snow? Yes. They really be having uh, darker um, meanings to them. The original stories are dark as hell. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Wow. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... Her name was Faith. Yeah. We should talk to the husband. You think he did it? Nah. But we can't rule him out, though. No, I don't. But we need to let him know about his wife. Dang. Finna make me go look up my fairy tales, head ass. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. Fables, fairy tales, that's the same thing. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Look if you like. Bro, is this from the real book? I'm telling you, bro, some of that shit was like actually dark. Shit's one good. This is her right here. I want to look at the ring. Yeah, that's her, all right. Long time ago. Who was that? Ichabod Crane. Scared shit. <laughs> What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Hmm. The they go old toad. Nice hat. I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. It was the three pig. That was one of the three pigs. Colin and his brothers. What? Beast. Beauty. Beauty. And the beast. Hmm. I think her name was Red. She didn't make it out. Oh shit! This is the adult version. I love this shit. Red Riding Hood's knight in shabby armor. The woodsman? Yep. And his axe. Is this me? I'm gonna do that one last. Yeah. Dwarves. The less said about that, the better. Yeah, that's me. Back when. Ugh. Long time ago. Mm. <laughs> Haven't seen him in a while. Well, that's how you looked when we met, remember? Yeah. Dang, that is the big bad wolf, bro. This fucking shit is lit, bro. Y'all say quit cussing. It's too early for all that. My bad, dude. I'm just now starting to realize how cold this uh this little fable games are gonna be. It's kind of nice. All right, what else y'all need me to look at? Hmm. Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Appalachia. Who knows where they were before then? Or what he did to get him. Strength. I guess it comes in all forms. All right. Who are we looking for? Yeah, we did that. We did that. It's a book of symbols. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm so sorry, y'all. Come on, where's where like what's up? Where's where's <laughs> where's my trigger? 
the trigger for the next. Oh, yeah, got to go talk to the mirror. Ask him about a uh, donkey. Yeah. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Mm. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. He's dead. What's he been doing? He's dead, bro. Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Somebody killed him too. Oh shit, is somebody trying to erase fables? Show me Faith's father, the old king. Guess that He's dead too. The suspect list. Show me Show me Faith. So the whole family's dead now. Her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? what? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Big B. It's simply the way this has to be. Whoa, whoa. She cloaked herself completely. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on. We're going over there. Sorry, I have to get that. Of course you do. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Big B, it's for you. I didn't know I was here. Big B, it's me, Toad. Oh, shit. You there? Toad, got your glamour yet? Yeah, 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 it's fine. Big B, shit. Listen, right, there's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big B, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was oh, that? Oh, what did Toad do? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. We gotta have to go to Toad. Should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Oh damn! Toad gonna be gone. Whenever you're ready. Toad gonna be gone. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Big B, it's me, Toad. I feel like we gotta go see what Toad's talking about, bro. We would never even known, you know, we would never got the drop if Toad would never called us in the first time. Let's go to Toad. like he needs help right now. We can check in on Prince Lawrence. Lawrence is already dead. He ain't going nowhere. Sitting in a damn chair. Unless somebody go pick him up. And we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. It looks worse than the day. Is somebody up there? Hey! Wait here. I shouldn't have said nothing. Shit. That sucker was big. You telling me he just moved through all that that fast? Shit. Should have waited. I should never said nothing. I 
I'm sorry. That's enough, all right? Just shut it. <laughs> Toad, take that shit back inside, bro. Son? Toads? I think. Damn. Be nice in there, okay? Alright. <sighs> Let's do this, y'all. Hey, Toad. You in there? <laughs> Big B! And Miss White! Why are you trying to shush Surely him? you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Why are you trying to shush him, Toad? Sorry, Big V. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought there was someone else in Woody's place. What? It wasn't, though. No, uh, not when I checked. Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have Oh, now this nigga lying like I didn't see so, that dude upstairs. You know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this, but thanks for coming. Much appreciated. What's going on? What do you mean? Bro, there was somebody upstairs, Toad. Nothing's now you're lying to me, on, bro? Baby. I don't know what you mean. Truly. False alarm is all. Sorry. He's lying to me. Are you all right? He's fine, Miss White. Let him answer, bro. Let him answer, bro. Than Walker, just like his dad. Let him answer, Toad. So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing, but it was nothing, really. I'll leave when I'm ready, Toad. I just want to check things out first. Yeah. I'm trying to push me out. The longer this takes, so just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, uh, have a my seat. time's already have been wasted. Whatever you like. Nope. He up to something, bro. Grown ups. Am I right? Uh Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. It has a weevil. <laughs> Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. So what's up with you, bro? How'd this happen? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. The lamp just fell off the table. Well, the boy was faffing about, playing sods and swordfish. Who knows with the lad? Hmm. Oh, it was never plugged up. You was using this for self-defense. Toad. Toad, talk to me, bro. I can only help you if you let me know. Hold on. Look at all this. Oh, it's blood on this. Hmm. What happened here? The poker? What of it? There's fresh blood on the tip. I could smell it from the door. I was I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Looked like a shit ugly thing. Sounds painful. Oi, don't you go mother ending now. Well, the where's where's your cut at? Very long, you know. Perks have been a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. Who oh, are you full of shit? You full of shit. Let me cut you out right now and see how fast you heal then. What is it now? If it's blood, you know what happened. I no, there's marks here on the window sill. And what's that about? No real reason. 
just last night when I'd come out, I was he in got a, an excuse for everything. As you would be. <laughs> and I plum <laughs> forgot the keys to this place. You bullshit. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Scared Junior off to death. That's fresh. Another spot of blood? Yeah, still fresh. Well, like I told you, I cut me hand. Ran around like a tit you said trying your to toe. a rap. Must you said your toe. Punishments. You said your toe. You say something out with it. Mm-hmm. Wait, you cut your hand? You told me before that you cut your foot. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sure, bro. This flip of events, really. You're giving me to run around. I don't like when people give me to run around, bro. Now I'm finna have some barbecue toad on me back in New Orleans. Oh, oh, shout out to them God, lovely people. Not make a big faff out of this. There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? Because it's hard to believe you. You lied to me the very first I mean, time I met you. Things happen, you know. No crime in a little accident. I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. But uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know yet. But I know you're lying about something. Something. But I'm not. And you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. Is he lying, y'all? Busted. Eh? If not, he keep a real like effed up house with his door. for his son. For Christ's sake, a fucking log's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. Hmm. Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? What's the point of all this, mate? Really? It's just a busted doll lock. Nothing to get your fur all wet. He talks his way out of that one. Come on, dog. Yeah, no, 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 no. Y'all ain't giving me a fair option right there. That was crazy. Hold on, go back up there. All right, so we. Here we I go. should probably get that thing fixed. <clears throat> I know something's off here, Toad, and I know you know I can't leave until I find out why. So can we please just skip to the end of the page before I have to get mean? I don't know what you want, Big B. There's nothing going on. I don't believe him. There's just, there's just nothing to tell. Look around the room and see for yourself. Everything has its explanation, you'll see. Honestly, Toad, I don't know if I will. And I don't know if I've got the patience to reverse engineer whatever scheme this is. Me boy's in the other room, Big B. Come on now. We're friends, right? I mean, I called you here. Can't we just start over? <sighs> so, let me tell you something, bro. If I find out you lying to me, dude, I'm going to punch your mother. Hey, I'm going to punch your eyes straight, dude. Hold on. Where, we, where, are you, where are you going? Where are you going, where are you going Wolf? Right there. What's that? Move something? What you mean? A That's the lamp. In the dust over here. That's oh, where the lamp was. Maybe one of Junior's toys or something. I mean, no. Nah. That's where the lamp was. Big B with a door and all. What you want? Yep, 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 yep. I like how he scratches chin before he go in. That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened. Yet. Oh my god. Nothing. Gosh. And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. So, 
It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here, and now it's there. The space in the dust is from where you well, moved I it. did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody I care. I'm trying to figure on, out what's going get on. Off with this. Big B, come on. I'm you don't move that lamp. Here, that lamp boy. don't move. I was looking That's why I got death nice rings around afternoon. it. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... They're sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please, please just bugger <laughs> off? Not yet. Not yet, you say to my face. Hey, you think I'm hiding something? There from was you? somebody well, here, to told. Room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here in my own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? I cut me end. I broke the lamp. Look at him trying to piece together the I story. The key, so I climbed the sill. Look at him piecing together There's the no story. More story to tell, mate. Man, look, dude. <sighs> This is all getting a bit stressful, all right? Please, just take it easy. I have my limit for bullshit, Toad. And I think we reached it ten minutes ago. Now, Dad! you're gonna tell me what's going on here, or I'm gonna start... Dad! <laughs> hey. <laughs> Baby, is this really necessary? Oh. <laughs> Bollocks. Maybe, uh, maybe. <laughs> Did y'all see TJ's face when he came out, bro? Dad. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Take Whoa. Your hat. I knew you were lying, Toad. You didn't. He didn't. <gasps> it was that butcher, a, a tweedle. Dumbo D, you gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. How the hell you sitting up here lying to me then? Screaming about something a woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a whole morning, I could tell you that. What did you tell him? If you're worried about your own skin, forget it. I didn't tell him nothing about you or your shit. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. Damn. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. <laughs> uh, sometimes. Borrows. I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. Why would you lie to me, Toad? God damn. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wait. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Dude, Prince is dead. Don't make it a dilemma. The Prince is dead. Open that, John. I'm sorry. Faith. Are you kidding me? What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. But maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? My I'll man leaking from the cranium. I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. <laughs> I 
Y'all gonna need to move. It's time to go for me. Wolf ain't say nothing about no witness protection plan or nothing. It's time to go. I'll be honest, Bigby. I don't really know how to feel about what happened in there. We got what we came. So for. what? I had to rough him up a little bit. He was lying. You thought I hit him. I ain't even touch him. I mean, I picked him up. So the prince is now? Lawrence is. Yeah. It's our best lead. Shook him like our a little action figure, but he good. When you put it that way. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? His door open. Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. If it's apartment number 72, You're his door is open. Fabletown business, and we can be persuasive if <clears> necessary. <throat> or you can. Yep. Look, 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 look. his door is open. Man, open that thing. We know he is dead. Reek of a dead body. Question is, did he do it? And what did she say sorry for? Did she set him up? Oh my god. Damn. Whoa. Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with you. No. Him. No. Let me go. Oh, cause he a fable. Damn, look at this hole in his head. What is it that you're telling us? Water. Bigby, water. Kitchen. By the time I get back, he ain't he ain't gone. He ain't gone. He gonna be gone. Come come on. Did you find it yet? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. Faith left him a message a long time ago and told him don't even come looking for her. If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Who did this to you? <laughs> come on, man. Faith. <gasps> No. Do you still have that letter? Yes. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Damn, that's crazy. Yep, gotta check the murder weapon out. It's sharp. There's blood on the blade. Of course, Wolf. Is that Come the same on now. Knife you saw in the mirror? <clears throat> I don't know why it's over here. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? Hmm. 
I think they trying to take the whole family out. Or that wouldn't make sense because like dad and uh shit like that's already been dead. That like they already been dead. Lawrence and Faith are really just a very edge to this pool, like some first new ones like dying. <laughs> you and i cannot endure knowing that i have this was for so he did this to himself and love your devoted lawrence hopefully they're together now about all we can hope for at this point damn dog <clears throat> Tough love story. Tough love story. When do you think that was taken? Years ago. For all this. Huh? What's that? He was. Oh, the bullet hole. Damn, that junk went through his. Oh. Went through his whole cranium. Bullet passed through the chair. angle works if he shot himself but, but what's up with the knife though damn I ain't even see that They'll be on the grip and the trigger. What are they? Painkillers? Sleeping pills. Yeah. My man, my man was, I mean, was doing the freaking complete just suicide, just jumping off the cliff, complete, just everything. Liquor. Prescriptions. The whole vibe was really off. Help. What else y'all want me to look at down here? What's going on? <clears throat> Dusty. No one's read these in a while. So that's not a clue. I mean that they were broken up. You know what I mean? So that means that there was a maybe a, a fight or a disagreement, altercation before all this happened. Oh shit, motherfucker! Stay hey, that's here. him. No. Bro, why did I really just get scared here, bro? Not scared, but like nervous. Had a little hey, jump scare. Stop. Come here, bro. That you were you were the mother. Yup, come here. Leave me alone. Hell no. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. Huh? Come here. Ah, oh, damn. Wrong button. Yup. Yup. Mash, 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 mash. Let's go. Uh. Yup. 
That's because the three B. That's because the three B on the door was uh swinging up and down. Come on, bro. You gotta use them instincts. Oh damn. damn. You've got to be kidding me. Oh yeah, you gotta be fast on these button mashes. Faster than Walking Dead. Oh, that boy upstairs. I missed it. Oh, I missed a jump. Uh, uh excuse me. Oh. Hey. Your ass over here. Who is that? Ease up, Bippy. We're on the same side here. You. Son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Why? <laughs> Just like run? we were playing on our boy Connor. <laughs> I do not like when they run. Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? Stop and tell me what man, the hell you were dead. doing. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look. I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Uh, the fuck? Don't oh, ever no. make me run, bro. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. Oh, shit. <gasps> oh! He almost looked peaceful. Damn, did I just give away a lead? Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Damn. Yep. <laughs> Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you and the other one finished kicking you. That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. I'm D. Guess we're he out of options. Dumb. <laughs> trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got. Y'all said it's a good game. One of good the game, good game. See faith good alive. Game. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby, be honest with me. Who do you think did this? Damn. I know it's still early, but I just feel a step behind. I don't know. I want to say the wisdom, but that's too obvious. That's way too obvious. I still think the husband probably did it. After everything we saw? There's still a lot of questions. We find the woodsman, figure out what he knows, and go from there. Makes sense. Because the woodsman was actually drunk going towards the pawn shop. Thanks I wish you. there was. Oh, yep. All right. <laughs> Sorry. Wolf not leaning in for no kiss, y'all. That's not his uh, profile. Go ahead. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's. Come on, man. I'm trying to be a gentleman right now. It's nothing. I just. Go back to wolf mode. Yup. Go back to wolf mode. Don't even worry about it. Go back to wolf mode. Seeing all this today. Are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. 
We pay so much attention to the residents of the Woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. Hmm. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. Crane is the one to blame here, not you. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. I'm more to blame than anyone. You'll fix it. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. System fucked up. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. A way to help. You should stick it out. There are fables that would give up a lot to be in the position you're in, and I think it's easier to change something from the inside. You're telling me change comes from within. Uh, sure. Not the advice I imagined hearing from you. I'm full of surprises. Uh, maybe you should handle this one. Yeah, maybe I should. Big B. What's up? Tell me, tell me. Talk hey. to me. Um, just be careful. I um just Please. be careful too, Snow. The same goes for you. I will. <laughs> yeah. Don Wolf. Let's get it. All right, y'all. That's going to bring us to the end of today's video. If y'all are enjoying this series, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, hit the noti bell. So y'all are here next week when we drop another video. This has been your boy OG Don XO. Y'all tell them we out this time.